hi welcome to creative learning today in this video we are going to discuss about english grammar now today's topic is noun you already know about noun what is noun a noun is a word which is used to denote a person place animal or thing a noun is used to denote person place animal or a thing noun means a word which is used to denote person place animal or a thing for example shilpa john bengaluru shimoga iron steel plastic are a word which is used to denote a person place animal or thing next we discuss about kinds of nouns now there are five kinds of nouns they are common noun proper noun collective noun material noun and abstract noun first is common noun common noun proper noun collective noun material noun and abstract noun common noun means a word used in common or it is a name given in the common to every person or thing of the same class or kind for example common noun as usual if some boy in in home his mother called him john or pick name man woman boy girl this is nothing but a common noun more examples are king queen and so on common noun which is used usually in common languages as usually fixed name for example fruits birds next is proper noun proper noun is used to denote a particular person place animal or thing it is called proper noun it is used to denote particular person place or thing particular name is used for example subhash subhash geeta or bengaluru are called proper noun it is used to particular person are called proper noun next is collective noun collective noun means a collective noun is the name of the number of person or thing taken together and considered as one whole example if there are 100 100 chocolates we call as bunch of chocolates herd flock family in family parents parents their children are present so they are called family flock means the birds birds group are called flock herd means the animals group are called herds next team of indian cricket team hockey team committee committee of officers committee of generals next bunch next fleet are the examples of collective noun next is material noun material noun means the word which is used to indicate the name of the material if we use this steel then we call it as steel this is a metal so i call this as steel which is a particular material is used so that is that one is called material noun used to indicate name of materials oil iron gold and so on next is abstract nouns abstract noun means a word which is used to denote a 
denote an unseen thing which can only be felt or spoken of a or thought of it is called abstract noun which we do not see the objects we are, we are talking about such objects are called abstract noun unseen objects are called abstract noun for example honesty bravery and next is kindness are called abstract noun which we do not see are called unseen unseen thing which we do not see in with the, our naked eyes are called abstract nouns honesty bravery kindness friendship and so on these are the kinds of noun first is common noun proper noun collective noun material noun abstract noun next we discuss about noun gender noun gender means there are four kinds of noun gender first is masculine gender and next is feminine gender common gender and neutral gender no masculine gender means the noun denotes all male characters all male voice all male characters are called masculine gender example father uncle brother boys which denotes only male characters are called masculine genders male characters and this is opposite this is another name of masculine this is female example mother sister girlfriend and so on are nothing but aunt are nothing but feminine gender female characters are called feminine gender next is common gender common gender means a noun used to denote either male or female character is to be common gender example child cousin doctor lawyer teacher etc next is neutral gender in neutral gender is nothing but a word which is used to denote the gender which is not a male nor a female example tree books etc computer laptop etc next we discuss about noun in numbers noun in numbers one is singular and another one is plural noun in numbers can be divided as singular and plural singular means part if there are many parts then it becomes plural so it becomes parts next is women women is also plural of form of women is women next example is girl if there are many girls then it becomes girls next is book only one book so it is called singular if there are many books used then it is called plural books next is tiger plural tigers and so on are the examples of problem problem is singular next if we add uh, there are many problems then it become plural so it become problem means problems and this is nothing but uh, our uh, noun thank you for watching this video if you like this video share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my channel for future updates thank you